draw this up here. We have A, which is down here, and it's 5, and B is 12, and we are trying to find C. So C is our unknown. So this is a forward Pythagorean theorem problem. So we're going to take A squared plus B squared equals C squared, and we're going to plug in 5, and we're going to plug in 12 and solve for C. So you get 25 plus 144 equals C squared. Well, these add together to 169 equals C squared, so we're going to take the square root of both sides. And remember, when you take the square root, you actually get two answers, a positive and a negative. But we know that a length can't be negative, so we're only going to look at the positive today. So C is 13, so that means this hypotenuse is 13. So that's actually a common triple, a 5, 12, 13. So you need to put that in your memory. Now, we also need to find the area of that triangle. Well, the area formula, remember, is 1 half the base times the height. Well, the nice thing about a right triangle, the base and the height are the legs. So in this case, our base is 5 and our height is 12. So 1 half of 5 times 12. Well, 5 times 12 is 60, and half of 60 is 30. So this would be 30 square units, and that would be the answer for the area. Okay, so that one's fairly easy. It's a forward problem. We're just solving for C, and we're finding the area of the triangle.